Hey everybody, welcome to this brand new webinar training where you'll be learning exactly how to start and grow a successful digital expert and consulting business in India even if you have absolutely no experience to begin with. So this means basically welcome to this one video where we are going to do our best to pitch you our amazing program. Now by the time you complete this entire webinar, you will know exactly Ambani bhi to ek webinar dekh raha tha na aur ab dekho relaunch khol li In fact it's highly recommended that you shut down all the distractions that you have open because this webinar is about to provide you with tremendous value By the time you actually finish this webinar till the end we also have a free bonus that's waiting for you at the end Netflix Amazon We are Uability, and we help people get high-ticket clients across the globe. Our mission is to help India become the number one source of talented service providers and consultants across the globe. Because talent should not have borders, right? Now, this is how our core team actually looks like. That's me, the founder here at Uability, and my name is Rohan Thapa. This is Pratham Sharma, the principal consultant here at Uability. And that's our CEO Max. That means Chief Entertainment Officer. Hey, Max. What? Uability was formed based on my personal experience of running a six-figure agency at the age of 20 while working with clients like Lindgren, the founder and CEO of 1% Group, a very famous success. That's me, the founder here at Uability, and my name is Rohan Thapa. This is Pratham Sharma, the principal consultant here at Uability, and that's our CEO Max. That means Chief Entertainment Officer. Hey, Max. Hey. Uability was formed based on my personal experience of running a six-figure agency at the age of 20, while working with clients like Lindgren, the founder and CEO of 1% Group, a very famous successful fitness consultancy company inside of Melbourne, Australia. Adam Mash, who is the CEO and founder of AMTG, a very well-known stock trading consultancy company in the United States of America, and travel around to places like this: Scotland, we got Prague, we got Indiana, and there are many more. Chal, chal, chal. A core group. Ah, kya pata nahi. And today, UAPT does 1.42 CR a month, and my age is just 26. But you know what? I'm not proud of our numbers and our own results but what I'm really really excited about is the impact that we are making. Now since launching we have signed over 1200 clients, produced over 588 case studies, produced over 160 plus trust pilot reviews and over 60 plus video interviews of successful clients. And as you can see, here's the proof of our Slack channel where every time somebody gets a new high ticket client they actually post it in our community and you can see the number 587 that's the number of wins that we have produced till date you can also see a preview of these wins by going to our website and clicking the reviews tab where you can see you know if you literally scroll down you can see a conga line of these images that we took from our community of our clients actually closing so, these deals and you can also go to a youtube channel where you can see over 60 plus interviews of our top clients getting amazing results and you can also go to trust pilot to see how everybody who has taken our program is literally leaving a review and rating us above 4.9 stars out of 5 And also, we are proud of getting results like what we did for Akshay Abhinav and Nirmit, who were able to produce a million dollars for fitness trainers globally. Right? So they are the founders of Trainer Goes Online, and when they started working with us, they were doing around about thirty-seven thousand rupees per month, selling websites to other fitness trainers and basically helping them out. However, after they decided to work with us, 
we suggested to them that hey rather than just selling websites what you should do is create an entire package which allows your uh, personal trainers or your clients to actually get a transformation which is growth in their business not just websites and just by taking this advice they were able to scale their business to 18.86 lakhs a month within a period of one year as you can see they said achieved a monthly revenue of $5,500 in November then they were able to crack $14,000 in December 2020 and over here as you can see uh, they say that now had, had we have hit the maximum milestone which is 25k in sales right we also work with people like Rajul who is the founder of RRR Media and before his situation was that he was unable to scale past 7.4 lakhs a month as he lacked a predictable way to generate qualified appointments and after working with us his agency literally had a 13 lakh day which became the new normal and as you can see over here he says uh, just thought of qu uh, sharing this quick win in the last 24 to 48 hours collected 18.8 k cash via different processors which is almost 1.34 million INR right we also worked with Pulkit Ravel, who was able to produce 1.5 crores in net profit in a period of 10 months. Now, Pulkit is the founder of Digital Sutra, which is a marketing agency. Now, back in the days, he was doing an IT job and he was pretty frustrated with that 9 to 5 shift because of the traffic, daily commuting and all that stuff. And after, we basically suggested him to actually launch a marketing agency, work with international clients. And as you can see over here, he says that, hey, uh, just wanted to share with you that I have produced 1.5 CR in the last 10 months in net profit. This is in the bank. As you can see, this is a screenshot of the same that he was able to share with us. Okay. Now, a client to success ratio is over 50%, more than any other online coaching company that you can find in the entire country. No other company can actually match a client to success ratio, not even close. And this is why brands like these actually trust us. These include people like Digital Deepak, the founder of Alpha Club and Learn Today. And as you can see, he says, part of uh, the UAPD mastermind, we seven extra prices, we are happier, richer and have more time. F low ticket. And as you can see, Giant also posted, who is his partner, that our sales rep just closed his first two deals for the first time. I see money coming in without me being involved. And we also work with Gaurav Madan and Roshni Dhal who literally start working with us and as you can see they say uh, your sales framework is working close four out of four deals roshni pitch another for eighty thousand plus gst this means they were able to raise their prices and increase their profitability by selling high ticket items we also work with karthik naidu the founder and ceo of my pipeline who literally had a 50 lakh plus day with a single webinar that he was able to do by selling his high ticket software we also work with viral and saloni jen who are successful amazon consultants and as you can see viral says i've closed around about eight people since the last three days of launching we also work with people like gopal krishnan who recently joined us and we have basically already started working with him to increase his prices and get him far more results with his existing funnel that he is already running at a huge scale and this is how our community looks like this is how we hang out this is how we collaborate and this is how we grow and it allows us to actually get together network with each other collaborate and scale to the next level so our clientele includes some of the best online coaches and consultants in the entire nation and this is why I'm not getting when I say when it comes to high ticket mentorship you are in the right place in fact the best place and the only place interesting right? Think that. now at this point of time you might be thinking how are these people actually making so much money and what exactly are they doing so without wasting any more time let's get straight into the content so who exactly is a digital expert and what exactly do my clients do well if you don't already know human beings individuals or business owners it doesn't matter are never satisfied with their current situation and they are always on the conquest of more this could be more wealth better health or meaningful relationships chances are that you're watching this video because you are also on the conquest for more now here's the catch people are unable to fix their problems on their own they need a faster route and want somebody to hold their hand towards the right path now, if you can connect the gap between their problems and desired possibilities, you can become a digital expert, just like how these other people are doing. 
So as you can see, here's an example. This is the current situation of somebody and their desired self is to have more wealth, better relationships and better health. Now, as I told you before, most people don't know how to fix their problems on their own. They don't know how to reach their desired self and they need an expert to guide them. Now, let's say that you come into the picture and you say that, hey, I will help you out and you will offer them your services or your advice. And in exchange, these people actually pay you your fee. And what you provide to them is your unique solution that will help these people go from their current self to their desired self using one to five steps depending upon however many you choose. Now here's the thing, if you can coach and consult your clients to become their desired self, then you can charge high ticket prices. Now here's the future of becoming a digital expert. A big question that a lot of people ask is how much money can you make? The answer to this question is there is no limit on how much you can charge as a consultant. However, you can demand anywhere between rupees 35,000 to rupees 25 lakhs a month per client. Now, if you are offering services like let's say architecture or design or something like that, you can even charge in crores. So what exactly do you do? Well, you help your target market achieve their goals by offering advice or services digitally, just like how I'm offering you my advice digitally right now. How do you do it? By delivering the service directly for the client, teaching them online via video calls, or maybe launching an online course. Hello, hello, hello. Easy. I'm sure I require a lot of certifications, experience, and not to forget, grow some money in seed and investment capital from angel rounds, correct? Or a minute, communication skills? It's not so much money in my class. Now, there are a lot of misconceptions regarding this business. The first one is people think that it requires a lot of experience and certifications before starting out. People think that you require exceptional communication skills to do this business successfully. One needs to have a lot of technical knowledge before starting out. One needs to have a huge team, office and a workplace to get started. The fact of the matter is that all of these misconceptions are just nothing but misconceptions and they are not true. So don't believe anybody who says otherwise. And to give you proof, check out Driftopal Bhattacharya who is still in college probably the last year and is making consistently upwards of 90,000 rupees per month while working with clients across the globe. Padma Shri wanted to restart her career. However, she did not want to travel just like how she used to because now she has a family to raise. That's why she became a consultant and now works from the comfort of her own home while obviously enjoying her personal time with her family and her children. You can also see Avinash who was able to actually close all his deals in Hindi itself. Okay. <laughs> Listening. Point number one. High ticket is greater than low ticket and always better. So here's the problem. Most business owners undersell their services due to limiting beliefs and end up attracting clients that cause headaches in the long run. This also reduces their profit margin, disallowing them to actually scale. And as you can see, here's an example of a low ticket item. Let's say that you get 10,000 leads, which are so many leads to get. And then out of these 10,000 leads, you manage to convert 100 clients at 1% conversion rate. Because it's very difficult to manage 10,000 different leads, right? So out of these 100 people, let's say they all pay you 5,000 rupees, you ended up making 5 lakh rupees for so much effort. Now out of these 100 people, you will get 80 support queries because these 100 people require help and support from you. And then you will need to hire a lot of staff for fulfillment because obviously you need to take care of your customers. And then this will give you low margins because you'll be spending all your money in hiring and all the operational expenses. And then eventually you will get dissatisfied customers who will ask for refunds because the more customers you sign, their experience keeps on decreasing. So Mr. Business Owner, how much revenue do you make per month? 10 lakh. And is this your profit? Minus one lakh per month. So the solution to this problem is solve bigger problems and increase your prices by shattering the beliefs that are stopping you from charging what you're truly worth. 
when you charge high ticket what you need to do is you need to get 200 leads which are very easy to get and in fact if you watch this training till the end i will show you exactly how to get them then out of these 200 leads let's say we convert one percent which is around about two clients that we can easily convert out of these let's say we sell these two clients at rupees 2.5 lakhs per month that equates to 5 lakh rupees in sales that we made by selling to these clients now out of this what we will get is one to two support queries because before somebody pays a high ticket rate we usually ask all their questions before paying the money as a result you won't require a lot of staff maybe one person who can actually handle their day-to-day -day activities you will get 70% plus profit margins and you will be able to provide personalized support and have happy customers in the long run. To give you a proof of this and a live case study, Nano entered the low ticket volume market by becoming the people's car with projected sales of 2,50,000. Real time sales were recorded as 7,591 in the year of 2016 to 17. So as you can see over here on the right side, the margin per Tata Nano sold was just rupees 10,000. So this means for every car that was sold, the company was making rupees 10,000 or that was the projection at least. But on the other hand, if you focus on becoming a Ferrari and charging a high ticket by solving bigger problems and targeting the right kind of demographics, you have the ability to earn, you know, even rupees 69 lakhs per car sold just like Ferrari. This is Saurabh. He runs an agency in Gurgaon, Haryana. Now, not too long ago, before joining us, he was struggling to get these higher ticket clients. He used to always get clients who used to cause headaches, delay the payments and ask for discounts. Now, you can see his transition on the left side where he achieved his first target of making $7,500 on 28 June. And this is on a retainer basis. And then on the right side, he got the biggest win, which was in October where he signed a client for $36,000 by providing him artificial intelligence services. This is Javed Mistri. Before working with us, he was making 30,000 rupees per month as a job at an agency offering digital marketing services. His goal was just to simply come and make 1 lakh rupees per month and have some passive income. After working with us, he was able to raise his prices and make upwards of 5 lakh INR monthly revenue since joining Uability. In fact, he also owns a company in Texas, United States of America now. But, but the competition is so much. How can I charge more? Point number two. Competition is for losers. Peter Thiel, co-founder PayPal, first investor in Facebook. So the problem is most consultants begin by entering broad markets, acting like genderless and competing with big sharks where the water is already bloody. This means they are competing with companies that have been there for decades and there's absolutely no chance of winning. If you don't believe me, just simply head over to Google and irrespective of whatever you do, just type your industry space near me. To give you some examples, you can see NLP practitioner near me, IT consultants near me, fitness consultant near me, digital marketers near me, etc. The competition over here is pretty intense and as you can see, there are millions and millions of people competing against you if you're acting like a genderless. So what's the solution? Well, just become a specialist by selecting a niche and eliminating your competition by default. This means rather than going in the red ocean, picking your own blue ocean and not just competing against the sharks. So what do I mean by this? On the left side, you will see somebody who's a genderless competing in the red ocean saying something like, I'm a fitness trainer where the competition is 1 million people. Now, how do you form your blue ocean? Just look at the example on the right side where this person says, I'm a fitness trainer for dads over 35 looking to gain muscle in New Delhi. The competition automatically becomes one to two people, allowing this person to form their own blue ocean. Let's take into account another example for a business term. On the left side, the person is a genderless saying that I am a digital marketer, competition being 1 million and the ocean being red. On the right side, the person says I help dentists in Delhi get more patients using digital marketing where the competition automatically becomes 1 to 2 people, allowing this person to have their happy blue ocean. 
Now there are certain benefits of doing this. By sharpening your squad over and over again, this means by working with just one type of industry and being a specialist, you gain effectiveness and efficiency. This means you will develop templates, skills and experience catering only towards that one niche, allowing you to become a true expert. In the words of Bruce Lee, I fear not the man who practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, allowing them to become a true expert. But Rohan, what about so many of these clients that I won't be able to then get and the missed opportunities? Okay. You can take into account the example of Amazon. Before they became the billion dollar company or trillion dollar company that they are today, they started off just by selling books. They became a specialist in the world of books and establishing themselves as a multi eight nine figure company before going out there and becoming the everything store that it is today. You can also take into account Facebook that just started off by serving Harvard students and becoming a specialist in them. Later on, they expanded to other college students and eventually the world that we see today. Meet Pulke Travel, who is a digital marketer who was operating like a generalist as well. In fact, he used to cater towards every person or every kind of business owner he used to come across. We turned him into a specialist and just by working with us, he first transitioned into 8.8k per month in gross monthly retainer fee and net is 6.2k. So after this, he signed another client and that was able to be done for $2,000 a month. And then finally, he was able to get a client for $1,500. Now, if you add that up, that's approximately 8.31 lakh that he is making every single month by selecting his niche and becoming a specialist. You can also meet Hardik and you can also meet Harley. Now these two people were basically operating like generalists before and they were just serving to everybody. What we helped them do is we helped them become a specialist and only target certain demographics of people who would be most interested in working with them. In their case, it turned out to be hair spa and salon owners. So as you can see on the left side, Hardik signed a deal for 500 pounds and Harleen signed a deal for 800 pounds together as a company. But Rohan Paji, which is the most profitable niche? Now, actually help a brother out. Give me a list of top 100 niches. Kama san The problem isn't your niche, it's really your offer. Most consultants believe there is some magical niche out there that's waiting for them that unlocks success for them. That's actually false. And if somebody offers you some sort of list like such, just ignore it. The fact is that every niche participant buys something and that's how the global economy functions. Think about it. Haven't you bought something ever? And you have. This means that you are a niche participant. And if you ask your friends and family, literally everybody has bought something once in their life, definitely. And the fact is that if you're not getting sales, it's not because you selected the wrong niche. The fact is that you need to work on your offer and that's what needs improvement. Point number three, features don't sell. The problem is consultants usually have offers that aren't great because they focus too much on technical jargon, which is features and providing extra information that nobody cares about. As a result, when the sale doesn't happen, they end up blaming their niche or the market. By focusing on features, consultants often position their offers like vegetable prices. Monday gul gaye, Monday gul gaye. Madam, digital marketing, IT service, graphic design, SEO idhar, naya yaar, man freelancer, super super madam, ek dam badiya sasta dam, pacha. Madam, 30,000 rupee done karte hain, man. 20,000, final rate madam. Ma please, 20, 15,000, please, please ma'am, please. And as you can see, I want to share with you a simple example. Let's say that you are stuck on an island, right? You're stuck on an island and there's no food, there's no shelter, there's no family, no proper water for drinking. Now let's take into account there's an island nearby and uh, over there, there's your family, there's food and water, there's shelter and there's friends. And then somebody comes into the picture and they say that there's this boat that can actually take you from island number one to island number two. The question is, do you think anybody could put a price on this boat? The answer is absolutely not. And this is the way that you should sell your services or advice as well. So the solution to this is get out of the building, talk to your customers, understand what exactly is their core problem. Where are they stuck and what kind of island do they want to actually go towards? 
and create an offer that will help your niche reach that island number two just like how I showed you earlier. Talk about the final destination and not the design of your boat. And as a proof, you can see, check out what Pradeep and Kamal were able to accomplish by making this simple adjustment to their offer. Meet Pradeep Kumar, who is an accountant, and his goal was to teach other people his accountancy knowledge and help them score better in their exams or other preparation. And as you can see, hi Rohan Dhawan, feeling happy to express that I have signed 17 students of professional financial accountancy by organic traffic and 9 students are under pipeline and he's selling each one at 35k which is approximately 5.95 lakhs that he was able to generate in one single month. You can also see Kamal who says close two deals this week one for 87k and the other one for 54k. The strategies that he learned was number one hand objections, asking straightforward questions, selling solutions and not services. He focused on the island rather than the port's design. Okay. Number four, client generation. The problem is consultants lack a foolproof system to generate inquiries consistently that they can predictably convert into customers. As you can see, according to a survey done by PayPal, the number one problem of number of consultants and freelancers inside of India is irregular income. There are different kind of mistakes that consultants actually make. Number one, tech overload. So I have this funnel inside of a bigger funnel which has an upsell inside another funnel all of this is inside a vada pav number two third party platforms reliance so i pay to just dial india mart sulekha fiverr upwork true lancer guru and sir how many quality clients do you get per month zero Number three, focusing on likes slash followers rather than focusing on what's important. So let me take a selfie for my 100k followers who pay me nothing. And number four, traditional strategies. Hello? Anji, sir, insurance, 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 sir, my baat suni, in one minute ki insurance. So what's the solution? Just build a simple 5 step funnel that gets clients with predictability. As you can see, Pius Hardwaj, who was just like you, he just focused on developing his simple 5 step funnel, which looks something like this. He uses platforms like email, Facebook, LinkedIn in order to find the right kind of people who would be most interested in working with him. After that, he basically takes these people and takes them towards something called as his opt-in which is a simple page where anybody could enter their name and email address. Now over here on this page, let's say that he gets 1000 clicks from email, Facebook and LinkedIn. Out of these 1000 clicks, let's say that 150 people actually enter their name and email. If 150 out of 1000 people enter their name and email, this means that we have a 15% conversion rate. Right? Now what happens is, once somebody actually goes through this option page, they are redirected to a video. Now this is a short and crisp video explaining everybody about what their business is about and how they can actually benefit by working with Pius. Now let's say that out of all these people, out of 150 people, let's say only 135 people end up watching this video because other people had other work to do, so they decided to just exit. This means that we have a 90% viewership rate. This means that 90% of the people who enter their name and email would end up watching our video that we created for them. Now out of these, let's say that 13 to 14 people click on the button that's given below the video and fill out a simple form to book a call and talk to Pius. So this means that if 13 to 14 people out of 135 actually end up booking a call or applying for a call, this means that we have a 10% application rate. Right now, this these are people who are highly qualified, who are actually seen the video, and who are interested in working with buyers. Not just any regular Tom, Dick, and Harry who just inquired randomly on the internet. Now, out of these 13 to 14 applications, let's say that you generate four to five qualified calls because some of the calls you had to cancel because they didn't have the budget, or some of the calls didn't actually show up, or any kind of other problem. This means that we have a 30% show up rate on the calls 
and these calls can actually be done using a Zoom meeting or normal phone call, anything that you prefer. Finally, out of these 4 to 5 people, let's say that we get one sale, which is one customer, which is approximately a 20% conversion rate. So this means if you do 4 to 5 calls and you get one sale, that's a 20% conversion rate on the calls that you're doing. Now this allows buyers to generate amazing customers who give them feedback, just like how you see over here, 6 kgs in 10 weeks and 10 kgs in 12 weeks, right? So this is what Pius is able to accomplish just by using this simple system. Now if Pius wants 2 sales, then all he has to do is multiply his clicks into 2 rather than getting 1000 clicks, he will get 2000 clicks. Rather than uh, getting 135 views, he'll just double that. Rather than getting approximately 15 applications, he'll get approximately 30. And rather than doing 4 to 5 calls, he'll do 10 calls and that'll allow him to get 2 clients. Now this system is much more reliable and predictable than any other thing that anybody else does. And as a proof, you can see over here, Pius just stated, 2 EMIs plus 2 packages sold, 2 more coming today for payment plus 2 offline clients, that's a total of 70,000 INR in 7 days that he's making. And please note, an average personal trainer in India makes 25,000 a month. This also applies to Ramit Jaitwani. So this guy had fallen into the trap of launching online courses because that was thought to be the quickest way to make money and just by actually working with us. So basically by transforming his business from doing all that online courses to actually doing done for you and starting from the basics, he was able to generate 7.4 lakhs in 45 days. And he was doing barely 30,000 rupees earlier and struggling to actually pay his credit card bills. Point number five, retention is king. Now there are different types of delivery models out there. The first one is done for you services. This means a business whose work involves doing something for customers but not producing goods. The work that such a service does, right? This means that you are doing the work manually for the client, helping them get any particular result. Model number two is one-on-one -on -one coaching. This is where you transition your services into a coaching program and teach the client how to get results live using weekly Zoom sessions. Number three would be group coaching services. This is where you transition your one-on-one -on -one clients and put them all inside of one group, allowing you to save time and coach multiple people together. The fourth one would be online courses. A business which renders information or services in the form of pre-recorded videos that can be consumed by customers on automation and get the desired result that they want. Now the problem is consultants fail to keep their customers in the long run and fail to scale their business while maintaining healthy profit margins without getting involved in the daily chaos. The mistake number one was staying too long in the done for you mode. Now, if you remember, done for you is basically doing the work directly for the client. Now, unfortunately, most business owners believe that hiring more employees and offering more and more of done for you services is the only method towards scaling. As a result, their operation complexity increases. They have innovation depth. This means they are focusing more on operations rather than innovating their company. Their customers actually have a bad experience because when they grow and add more people, their customers actually don't get the same amount of attention that you would give when you had less customers. And as a result, you have also higher fixed costs because now you'll have to have employees, offices and other fixed and variable costs to take care of this beast that you have created. Hey, sir. Hey, sir. Hello. Hey, sir. Mistake number two is launching a course very, very soon. So a lot of people try to actually begin from top of the mountain and launch an online course even before working with the client one-on-one -on -one and understanding their basic problems. Consultants begin by creating fancy curriculums, spending money on expensive softwares and creating an online course just to make quick money without prior done-for-you experience or testimonials of any kind. As a result, their students don't get results and nobody attends their webinars or even buys from them. Bye, Vanega, India ka Tai Lopez. Alright, time to host a webinar. So what's the solution? Well, the solution is you work with your clients one-on-one -on -one 
till the time you are confident about your processes and after 10 plus success stories scale with online course model rather than hiring more and more employees and to give you a proof of this this is exactly what i did when i formed uability you can see over here i began by offering done for you services this is where i would do the work for the client make sure that they get results and make sure that they are happy and then i started doing one on one and group coaching in fact you can see there's pulkit right there who was just starting out back in the days and i was teaching him on this group session that you can see on google hangouts after that once my students started getting results and i was confident about what i was teaching i expanded to online courses just exactly what i have now allowing me to scale to the next level so what exactly did we cover today you learned that high ticket is always better than charging low ticket you learned that competition is always for losers features don't sell or client generation formula and finally retention is king now you have two simple options option number 1 is to do it alone now while doing it alone this will be slow and time consuming how do i know this because this took me 6 years to figure all this out 